guys, what's up, and welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Diva Time Gaming, and we're back again with another Wizard 101. So now we are currently continuing what we finally are doing. Oh, we gotta go give the potion to Bartleby. Um, if you guys did not see the last one, we fought Sergeant Skull Splitter to get the book back for Gloria, which was Sylvia's notebook in originality, and we also fought what's his name. General Achilles. So now we're gonna hold up while we're in the area. Before I forget, I'm gonna go refill my potion. And I need some mana. I mean. Fill one. Bye. Alright. Woo! Oh, stuff are still loaded. I did not see that. I don't know what that is loading over there. Some some rowboat? What's that? Or oh, rowboat? Oh, <laughs> that's about rowboat. That thing's a rowboat. <laughs> All right, let's see what Bartleby has to say. Must hold on to the first world until... Oh, it's so hard for me to remember things. My mind is not as clear as it once was. You pour the Headmaster's potion all around Bartleby's roots. Ah, that's good. Bartleby looks off into the distance and speaks in deep, hollow tones. Beware, Master Ambrose. Beware of Malastair. He comes at night to torment me. Find the one who can defeat him. That one is the savior of Wizard City. All right. And I'm assuming... I'm the savior of Wizard City, because why not? <laughs> Who doesn't love the adventure? Alright, the robot. I thought the robot was finished. Every time I move, something went down low. What was going on? It's a... Why going? Where are we? So that's what Bartleby had to say. My, how odd. Not the outcome I was quite expecting. Headmaster Ambrose scratches his head, thinking. Bartleby used to have two eyes. Gifts from his sister, Lady Nightstar, the grandmother of Ravens. They were called the Eyes of Time. One showed the past and the other the future. Recently, Malastair stole the Eye of History. Now, Bartleby can't remember things. Good. I will have to think awesome. upon Bartleby's wow. words about Malastair. Things are so dire, I must be sure to choose wisely. There will be no second chances. Exactly. Can't risk nothing. Alright. Before I do that, let's just make sure we know we took care of any nearby quest um i highly very much highly doubt i could even get there so yeah um well i am forever going the wrong way all right so We must go talk to Private Quinn. <gasps> Get land. Come on, come go with me, Get land. Christmas is approaching very, very soon. Oh my gosh, so much festivities are coming. Oh, 
Oh, let's go talk to Bowder. Bowder? I am Bowder Goldpaws, a Baldur? trader from far off Grizzlehide. Something like that. I've just discovered this world. I have sailed across the great sea of skies, establishing new ports to trade my wares in. You must be like, um, 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 I would um. like to establish what trade relations with the merchants Swanian. here, if they be friendly. I don't know. I can't Can do you help right me? now. Those... If Prospector Zeke is here, go speak to him. Then speak to your I mean, treasure you card say, dealer and anyone who sells furniture. If you can do that for me, I will be thankful. Me? How about that? That would be so much, you know, better and nicer. I, I mean, I would appreciate a little please here and there, you know? And what will she need? Greetings, young wizard. So, you're interested in learning about crafting? Wonderful. Oh. Let's get started with your first lesson. The first rule is to have a clean, well-lit place to work. For that, you'll need a basic crafting table. Oh, I'm see, happy I went to, to make you one if you can gather the supplies. We'll need some mist wood. You can find mist wood growing all over Wizard City. That's for sure. <laughs> Bring the mist wood back to me, and we'll soon have you a nice new place to work. I just wanted to see what she had eat. <laughs> Why? It's so cheap. Look how quiet, you know? It's a well, hello there. <laughs> I've not made your acquaintance yet. It's always good to see fresh faces here in Wizard City. I wish I had studied to become a wizard instead of, uh, becoming a town guard. Say, I found this book on one of the benches while I was strolling to work this morning. It looks important, and uh, I don't have time to drop it by the library. Would you take it there for me? Well, let me change this thing, because I'm just over here collecting things just to not do. <laughs> That's like so damn. I'm over here collecting quests just to not do. <laughs> I do that for real, man. I collect a bunch of quests and don't do them. <laughs> At all. Hey there, young wizard. How's it going for you so far? You explain that Balder Goldpaws asked you to help set up trade relations between Grizzleheim and Wizard City. That's great. Old Zeke's always happy to do business with the bears. Tell Balder I'll trade with him. Why, hello there, young wizard. Name's Zeke. Prospector Zeke. I've been all over the place, exploring the different worlds along the spiral. Each world I get to, I always find some and people are gone and forgotten. Like them dwarf-like fellers called the Smiths. Say, you and might help me out, would you? Those Smiths are hiding all around Wizard City. They don't do much good where they are. Locate them and let me know where I can find them, and I'll pay you kindly for your trouble. Ah. 
All right, those sneaky, sneaky little Smiths. Oh, I got to the Herald. Oh Lord. See, I tell you, I just be all over the place. I don't have no type of order at all. Hello there, young student. Welcome to the library. Can I help you find any book or card in particular? You tell Mr. Argleston about the trade agreement Balder is trying to set up. Oh, that sounds wonderful. I would be happy to trade treasure cards with Grizzleheim. I wonder if we can set up a library exchange program. You say you are returning a book that someone dropped? You are quite a good sport to take time out of your day to do that. Thank you for doing that. Oh, hang on there. This book does not belong to the library. Inside the cover it states property of Sabrina Greenstar. She well, probably dropped it on her way to the fairgrounds. You best give it to her yourself. All right, so Albert in the shopping district. The world is that? What is that? Is it? Is that a porcupine? I think it's a porcupine. Oh wait, I got a what? Oh, that's a pretty um. I don't know what it's called, but it's ready. Robert. Welcome to my shop, young wizard. Can I interest you in some furniture for your dorm room? Um, uh, You tell okay. Mr. Quickhammer about the flying boat with the trader from Grizzleheim. That's great. I offer a selection of furnishings from across the spiral. Adding imports from Grizzleheim will certainly be good for my business. Back the balder. <laughs> oh, um, I too close. Hold up. I know where I going in. Uh, can I get out? Oh my gosh, that homie hostage. Run it, run it, run it, oh, and get again, run it, run it, run it, run it, run it, run it, ow, run it, run it. Now I go a little closer, my gosh, you're gonna be all up in his mouth. 
Did you get yeah, agreement from know. the free merchants? I highly doubt his breath smell good. Good! You have brought two worlds closer together. You have my thanks. I would like to reward you for your help getting your merchants to agree to trade with my world. Would you like to take a quick trip with me to visit Grizzleheim, my home? It will not take long now that I know the way. You can greet some tradesmen from Grizzleheim and sure, see if they will if trade I can with go, Wizard City. You know, I don't know yet. In Grizzleheim, speak to Thrain Stormfriend, Vider Silverthread, and Dane Goldright. Let them know I sent you with word of new trade partners. Oh, I can go. Uh, all right, um, now, arrow make up your mind. You look like you could use a new rune-carved ring. I have just the one in stock. Before he tries to sell you something, you explain about the trade agreement. That sounds like a great idea. Sign me up. You should head back to tell Balder that we're willing to trade. Alright, alright, I feel that. We got other people to talk to, though. So you gotta hold up, sir. You there! Can I interest you in a new robe? This is a cold land, and you should try to stay warm. What size are you? Uh, I you small, explain I explain that you're not robe shopping. You're here to set up trade with Wizard City. Hmm. Trade with Wizard City? I can certainly do that. <laughs> I will have to get some smaller sizes in stock, though. <laughs> it's a... Uh... Welcome, young outsider. Where are you from, and what can I do for you? You explain that you're from Wizard City, and that you're here to set up trade with Grizzleheim. Sounds good to me. I'll trade with anyone with gold in their pocket. <laughs> gold dig and sell. Well, I mean, who don't like money, you know? <laughs> Back the ball, dirt ball, the ball, the ball, the ball, the ball. The... They're in agreement. Shot me. Good I news. We have done well this day. Ready yourself. I will take you home now. All right, I it feel was that. a pleasure working together. I wish you well in your future journeys. Thank you, thank you. You may be unable to return to Grizzleheim right away, but when you do return, your visit will be marked by kind words and open hearts. You must be at least 20th level to return to Grizzleheim. Oh, I'm about to say, because I know you gotta be high just to come back to Grizzleheim, but. For that one, they let you go. Quinn, where are you? Oh, I forget I gotta be finding the um, the um, the um, the Smiths too. <laughs> Woo, do not touch me. 
do not touch me, do not touch me, do not touch me. I said, do not touch me. Don't grab me, don't breathe on me, don't do nothing. Nah. Hey, you there. Can you give an old soldier hey, a hand? You I'm there. Private Quinn. Hey, you there. Hey, you there. Hey, you there. I was planning I to meet some fun friends here. Would you they do to show here. up? They like to have their fun with me sometimes, but with all that's happening, uh, would you check on them for me? Okay, I got you. Head over to Fire Globe Theater they don't where they try live to shoot and no see if they're all right. Me, I'll wait here in case they arrive my before neck. you do. We cool. You know? If they cool, I cool. We both cool. We can, we can hang and all that. The minute they come at me sideways, I come in back harder, okay? That's just how we go. Alright, we gotta go to Fire Glow. I say fire to the rain. We woo. I do some dangerous stuff, y'all. You know? <laughs> and I'll be like, no, don't grab me while you touch me. I ain't never been near you. I like to complain. But you see what I be doing? Um, well, I see a smith, so yeah, we're gonna make this little turn real quick, you know? I don't see anything, so... Woo! <laughs> Ooh, I like the thunderstorm. Thunderstorm, I guess that we is. That he's on. Help! It's coming! Ooh. You're back! Let me guess. They were playing a prank on me. Uh. Private Quinn falls ashen when you tell him about the Fire Elves. Oh no, that's no prank. You don't know them like I do. Something horrible must have happened to the Fire Elves. Once, a Did fire elf horrible? saved my life with an arrow. His name was Phoebo. He said we'd be friends forever because their magic connects everything they touch. That's it. Bring me their arrows and we can find out what happened to them. You'll have to duel a few of them first. Of course. I know. Of course. Why you can't just have one arrow? I don't understand. Why you need four arrows? Alright, they 150, so. Um. Let's cool them off a little bit, you know? No need to be tense and angry, okay? I'm nice, and as long as you nice, I nice. What in the. Oh no, we know we're not gonna do is burn me up to ashes, okay? You ain't gotta be that rude, okay? I'm trying to help you. I'm gonna need you to tone down. The burning, okay. Keep it to a very much minimum. Mi mi what? Minimum, minimum, not minimum. What? Minimum, ma, 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 ma. ma. <laughs> bye, bye. Deuce, deuce. Um, he got an arrow. Y'all gonna stop playing with me like this, <laughs> okay? I'm gonna go over here, cause I just wasted my time. Talk about he ain't got no arrow. I ain't know he got an arrow. Oh, cause somebody already in here. I just did what I say. Who is in my favorite realm? Ain't nobody usually be in here. Somebody snitching. Cause I showed up face snitch. What were you doing? The battle just start. You already wanna get in the middle?
battle just start and he already all up in the middle for what it's Um, don't be trying to hurt my ears like that. That's a big old no, 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 Ha, you fizzled. Ha, you, what the world? Uh-uh. Hey, you there. Hey. You they root out. Hi. You liar. I see you walk out. Hey. I just get bite up, eat up, shoot up. Like, what the hell? <laughs> what? What? Eh. I'm over this. Why am I not getting any arrows? I gotta go way over here. Whoever took all of the ales with the, with the arrows, fight me. Okay. Because this is what I color. Oh, no. I, I, I got to go back this way. Because there ain't nothing this way. Let me make sure ain't nothing coming. Y'all need to fight me. Because where is the arrows? Where? 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 Cause none of these arrows got no arrow. Why? I need to know who took all the arrows. This way, there's an arrow, and I would have had three arrows right now. But guess what? The first two ain't had no arrow. And the boy over here shooting with arrows, but they ain't got no arrow. I don't understand it. <laughs> Ooh, do not touch me. Do not do nothing. Leave me alone. At least, you know. Ooh, a chest. Let's go get it. Oh, I'm so confused on what I need. Give me this one, because that one, they probably had just... Get me! Come here! I'm not playing with you! Right now, I'm tired of this. I would like to. <sighs> I only got one arrow, 
out of the four or five ills I don't fight. One, one little piece of arrow. This is very stressful. It's, it's stressful. Come here. It's, uh, need I'm busy yay you were doing uh -uh. really well yay Come to the school for a new spell I got you after I finish with this stuff here Lizard, I hear you have reached level 10 come to me when you would like to learn I don't about ever ever never ever want to learn about no tournaments thank you my friend let me just mark this and go to her now the spell she will give me might be very beneficial Snowman, I love it. Cut them out. I love the snowman because they be that snowman be slicing the nine. Because I swear, people, they, people forever using the snowman on me and they be cutting my girl up. So I, I, I glad I can cut them up too. Yeah, you want to throw a snowman at me? I'm gonna throw him right back at you. Because what you not about to cut me and get away with Pardon it, me, young wizard. But what? your room is ready. You can find the dormitories in Raven. Your yeah, dorm yeah, room yeah, contains yeah, your bag. Yeah, yeah. There I you know. can store items that you don't want to carry. Visit the dorms whenever you like. All right. Now we need two. Two more. Um, what do I think all? Oh, else. Look at all of them right here. Right here in front. What are you doing with your life? Come here. One more, one more, one more, one more. Why old boy running? Where you running for? Why you running? Come here. Come here. Come here. What are you, what are you doing? I said come here. You trying to find, find a spot? Just drag me somewhere. Come on. <laughs> you gonna go in a circle.
All right, we did it. Finally. Ooh, all I see is burning L's just now. Ooh, that wind is very strong. Great. Thanks for doing this for the Fire Elves. You're welcome. If the Fire Elves are cursed or enchanted, and I'd bet my life they are, this arrow should reveal who did it. Greta Darkkettle used to teach alchemy at the school. She might help if you bring her the arrow. Alright, you guys. I'm gonna, um... In this part right here, I really hope you guys enjoyed. Do not forget to thumbs up this video, share with all your friends and family, and of course, subscribe to the game if you haven't already. Because what are you doing? And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.